तो हे गाइस वेलकम बैक टू चैनल माय नेम इज कीर्ति श्रियास एंड इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट हाउ यू कैन मैक्सिमाइज योर गूगल एडसेंस अर्निंग यस गाइस इन केस यू हैव मिस्ड इन माय प्रीवियस वीडियो आई एक्सप्लेन व्हाट इज गूगल एडसेंस हाउ टू अप्लाई फॉर गूगल एडसेंस how to get quick approval and then place ads on your website but when let imagine like you got approval now your ads has been displayed and starting displayed on your website but most of the times people are facing issue like they are not getting more and more conversion conversion means people are getting traffic but they are not getting earning why because they haven't done a right placement of the ads so in this video i'm going to talk about the three important thing where the first one is where to place the ads so that you will get more conversion second one is how to check for that particular keyword how much is the cpc and the third one is how you can maximize your earning what are the ways through which you can drive a traffic to your website so almost everything we will be covering this video so if you are new to this channel and really excited to know what is adsense how you can make money from adsense and very passive income ideas then quickly subscribe the channel provide your comment and share this video as much as possible so i will keep making more and more videos so guys without wasting time let's go to screen and there we will talk about first how you can check whether this particular keyword has this much amount of cpc or not so here we are on the screen guys do remember google adsense is a product of a google and google manage all its advertising revenue how much it will charge to advertiser how much it will going to pay to publishers all will be defined under a single portal and the name of the portal is google adword so what you have to do is in order to check for any particular keyword like what will be the expected cost per click of this particular ad in case that ad will display on your website then you have to come to google adword and there you have to sign in so i'm simply clicking here to sign in as you will sign in it will ask you for email id and password simply your google id just provide that email id and password then directly you will be landed on that home page okay guys so once you have done a sign up you will be on the screen and there you can see in case you have run any sort of campaign so you can see guys i'm actually running a campaign in the google adword to display some sort of ad to various places that's why this much is costing and everything so ignore that part now what you have to do is you have to check right so you can use a tool you have to come to this particular section and there you can see multiple uh, various uh, possible cases you can check out from here so in that case you have to go and click to keyword planner and within the keyword planner you have to type your keyword and do remember for every and individual keyword the pricing the cost per click based on the country and the language will keep changing so there you will be having this two options so first you have to type your keyword in order to check how much google might pay you so guys in that case let imagine like your post is all about search engine optimization and you have targeted a keyword that is seo services so let imagine this is the keyword you have targeted in your website and anyhow Uh, and then after you can choose here the country the country in which you wanted to check what is the expected cost per click so you can change the country from here in case i wanted to check it for united state okay so what i will do is just filter out country united states select that ignore the united kingdom and then save it so now what it will does is actually it will check now simply click here to get results as you will hit to get results what it will does is it actually give us an idea for that particular keyword how much people are ready to pay how much they are bidding in google adwords so if you will scroll down guys there you can see seo service is a keyword for this keyword this much is the monthly volume and if anyhow you have targeted this keyword and organically if you are getting any traffic from google or somewhere in that case guys you might have chances to make a 7 pound which is closely 10 dollar to 20 dollar for every single click so this is the only portal from which you will get a good idea or exact idea what is the cpc i have seen many people or many uh, uh, bloggers who are actually doing uh, searching the cpc in different different tools such as ahrefs sembrush uber suggest and everything so most of the tools are picking all the data from google adword only and they are not fresh data because this thing is keep changing whatever cpc is displayed right now there might be cases in the future it will change so every time whenever you want to check for your keyword repeat this process come to this particular location and try to understand what is the cpc right and then if you will scroll down there are a couple of keyword like if you have targeted as you expert then there are chances like you might make around 7 dollar to kareeb uh, more to 12 dollars somewhat so this is something the helpful tool which you can use yourself so now i hope you have cleared your doubt specifically where you can check your cpc now the next part is guys now your website is approved with google adsense so i will take the example of the same website 
okay so that you will get a good idea let imagine your website is approved with google adsense now the ad is started displaying on your website now it is time to maximize your conversion because i have seen many people who are actually getting impression for the ad but not getting clicks on the ad why because they haven't done a right placement of ad so what things you can do that that's what i'm going to explain here make sure guys whenever your page when you will start placing the ad the first position you always have to place link ad just below the title because the earlier you place the ad the chances are very high either it get impression or it will get a click and whenever you will place such kind of link ad people will think like these are the natural content link and there are chances that they will click it because ultimately these are the linkage with some sort of a product some sort of uh, some sort of a pages and their pages are actually promoting different different places right so those kind of ad display there so these are somewhat related to my post best alcoin and this is again best alcoin so there are chances like the people might click to this ad and you will get more conversion so my preference is always use link ad just below the title first second thing is guys on your right hand side because all the times whenever the people will open your page at least you should display two ads two ads to the initial pages so either place the ad at the top right corner in the sidebar or place ad at the second position so these two places either this or this either this or this these two places should always have some sort of ad that will increase your clicks or will conversion second part in case you are not having an option for link ad right because not everybody is having this uh, type of link ad option will be enabled after a couple of uh, days so in that case guys do remember to place display ad. you can see here display ad just after the first paragraph remember just after the first paragraph use a display ad because our ultimate goal is to display two ads whenever the people will land it on our page so one will be after the first paragraph and second will be on sidebar so these two things are very much mandatory then after always use a vertical ad on your right hand sidebar you can see here right hand sidebar that will again increase your conversion because there you can see a format of 600 by 160 so 600 is a vertical pixel so obviously you will get a wide coverage up to the half of the page so always use a vertical uh, add on your right side then again there is a couple of mix of combinations you can use within the content and make sure you have used maximum five to seven ads for a single post not increase above that and there are key people actually asking me about whether they should use auto ads or not my recommendation is do not use auto ads because if you will use auto ads there will be unnecessary ads on various various places which actually annoy your readers so avoid placing the auto ads always place a manual ad that will actually increase the engagement of the user as well as conversion so make sure you start using around uh, one ad after 10 or 20 pair 20 paragraphs all the time so you can see guys in this way i have split my complete ad with a various combination of either display ad link ad contextual ad and whatever the ad have always use at least two to three combinations on every individual pages so this is the way through which i'm actually placing the ad and at then when your post will end again place a horizontal ad you can see here if you will scroll down guys there this is the place there you have to place one ad at the end of the content which again actually uh, do not disturb the user but if they want it they can click it so whoever will go down from start from top to bottom they will again interact with that ad so these are the ad combinations you have to use on your website in order to maximize the conversion now let's go and talk about the third point how you can drive traffic to your very brand new website in this case guys basically you know whenever we will talk about the adsense earning the only key role is guys you have to drive traffic the more traffic you drive the more earning you will make and on an average for thousand views you will be making around four to five dollar in case your site is getting traffic from us or somewhere and if the traffic is from country like india there you will be making around one two dollars yes so three times lesser than to the western countries so make sure you drive a traffic and the best way you can drive a traffic is either sharing your content on social media or on quora or you can use arbitrage technique so what is arbitrage technique in that technique guys basically you are promoting your content on various uh, advertising platform such as google bing or facebook you are paying them around 100 rupees or you are paying them around one dollar or two dollar amount of time and if that two dollar amount of time will drive around 300 to 400 user to your website so in that case guys you can imagine the price difference difference you are spending 100 rupees or one dollar in return you might getting around two dollar three dollar so that margin will be your income and don't worry about you will be not getting banned and that is only way to get banned your google adsense account is when you will start clicking 
as an invalid click. So this is something guys very special. You have to understand what is Google AdSense, how you can maximize your earning, where you can check the CPC and almost where you can drive the traffic. If you wanted me to make a video on traffic arbitrage technique, provide me the comment for more. You can check out my site bloggingos.com and there you will be having an option to enroll for nine day free blogging series. You just have to go to bloggingos.com on that particular website on homepage. You have to provide your name and email ID for nine days. You will be trained in a blogging with all the master secrets. So if you are interested, really go to this particular site. Link will be in the description and keep checking, keep subscribing, keep sharing this video. So I will keep making more and more. I hope you enjoy this lesson or this video and keep enjoying more. Thank you very much for being a part of this channel. Thank you very much.